Good morning, good people. Good morning. We're here for our pre-market review. You guys know how we started off. We start by checking the futures this morning. Let's see what the futures has. Dow is actually down 0.28. S&P 500 down 0.27. And the NASDAQ is down 0.32%. That's not too bad, but that is also an indicator of the rest of the market. So that means the rest of the market is probably slightly down this morning. So we need to look out for that. See what kind of news we have. Dow Jones futures is market rallies. Watch for this. Apple nears milestone. Okay. Apple running up. We saw that yesterday and we saw my review of it and what my opinion on was of a buy was. I did not recommend buying to most of y'all right now because you'll be left holding the bag when Apple decides to come back down, and I don't want to see that. If you do feel comfortable enough, you can jump in on Apple, but you have to feel comfortable doing that. Dow falls 110 points, jobless claims, day to do. U.S. stocks finish higher. We're going to click on this one. It was dropped six minutes ago. Apple nears milestone. Trump spec stock DWAC soars. The Dow fell slightly Thursday morning, along with the S and P and Nasdaq. Stock stock market rally attempt had a quiet session Wednesday, with the major indices holding on to the prior two session strong gains. Apple is leading the way. Trump stock DWAC spiked 28 percent. Trump stock fell modestly in pre-market trade Thursday. Earnings at the owls. Game stock. Wednesday, Dow Jones fell 0.3 versus fair value. We have a few different things here. You guys can go in there and check it out yourself. We see Apple still running up. It said it's all-time high 175 for today. That's the 52-week high, I believe. So it's not no ba any bad news. We, looks like we got some good news going on. So we're going to check out our stock heat map. Okay. Check out our stock heat map. Okay. It looks like everything. We got a little red and we got a little green. As I mentioned earlier and the futures mentioned, two, Apple is up 2.28%. It's running. It's on a good run. Um, technology is doing decent and as far as the software sector semiconductor semiconductors is down it has some red in the video down 1.85 percent apple is up 2.828 percent the financials have some red you know that's including our paypal which is green over here that's a beautiful thing we'd love to see that um communications is green we got google and facebook here showing some green Healthcare is green Consumer slick cyclical. We got Amazon flat at zero percent. Bible is kind of flat at 0.37 percent. Energy is looking kind of good. It has some green industrials, utilities. Okay, we got some good things in here. It looks good. I mean, we got look like another mixed day. It may end up flat on the day. Um, if you decide to jump anything, don't don't jump in it while it's up high. Wait for it to pull back. So remember, we buy the dips. Be sure to buy the dips. Let's go see what crypto is looking like for the day. Crypto heat map. Cryptocurrency. Okay, I decided to come to Robinhood to see what the cryptocurrencies look like. Let's see what the cryptos are like. The cryptos are pretty much flat on the day. Nothing major. Bitcoin is down a little bit. It's down a little bit, but it's on its way back up. It has a pretty good trend up. It came down. And it's on its way back up. I think it might this this uh forty nine thousand dollar mark might be the resistance line, and it's probably gonna bounce back up. Looks like it came down heavy last night. I'll, I'll say it had a low of forty one thousand. I'm sure that was a, a minor spike, but it came back up. If anybody got in here, I'm sure they made some some good profits. Oh yeah, good profits here. Especially if you came back up, you saw it come back up. That'd been beautiful. Dogecoin stagnant. Ethereum Classic stagnant. Regular Ethereum. Let's see. It came down last night. It must. Have, it probably came down with Bitcoin. As I told you all earlier, most crypto follows Bitcoin. But it looked like it's on its way back up. Nothing major. 
hopefully you guys may have had you a, a limit order in there and saw it drop and made you some money on the way back up fairly quick um so that's that's pretty much all i have for you this morning uh my prediction for today is gonna be we'll probably see a little red early in the morning and we'll see things come back and normalize in some green so i don't see us having a too bad of a day hopefully but you never know looking at the dow we got 0 0.38 0 0.34 s p 0.31 and nasdaq 0.35 so there's always a possibility that it could drop more but you guys just be careful make some safe plays and try and make some money have a good day